volunteers are out in force at 10 Mile Creek Park, sawing, stacking, and of course, chopping firewood. Oh, so close. Well, I think we have a lot of people that need to burn wood for whatever, heating their homes or whatever, and they simply, maybe they don't have a truck, maybe they don't have an ax, they don't have the ability, maybe they're physically handicapped. So those of us that are more able can provide for those people. The Warm Hearts Warm Homes event is the second of its kind here. With two loads of logs provided by Mark's Lumber, the volunteers had plenty of wood to chop in preparation of giving it away for free to the public. This initiative is a partnership between St. Paul's United Methodist Church, Garden Works, Low Income Home Energy Assistance Program, or LIHEAP, Mark's Lumber, and Prickly Pear Land Trust. We had people from all around the valley, from up in the mountains, from as far away as Great Falls coming down to get loads of firewood. As winter gets nearer and temperatures drop, those in need of fuel to warm their home are able to utilize this free service. This service is especially helpful with this year's rising inflation. Most people are folks who are really self-sufficient, but they might be older, they might be disabled, they might not be able to collect their own firewood anymore, but they still heat their homes with wood. And so they're in a bind because, you know, buying firewood's expensive, and so this is an opportunity for them to heat their homes for free. With recent rate hikes at Northwestern Energy and a recent report predicting that families nationwide will pay 17.2% more than last year to heat their homes this winter, this free heating resource is bound to be welcome. Those hoping to gather some of this free firewood can reach out to the Low Income Home Energy Assistance Program, or LIHEAP. Reporting in Helena, Tom Buchanan, MTN News.